Well, let's turn to another court matter that has been in our courts now, at least for the last three years. ANC MP Matole Mutsecha has asked the High Court to withdraw his application. It's after he uh, previously attempted to oppose uh, Le Kukela Mujaji's inauguration as the Balubedu King. Uh, Dr. Mutsecha joins us now uh, to elaborate on this a bit more. Dr. Mutsecha, good evening. Good to talk to you again this evening. Good evening to you and to the listeners. So when uh, we listen to you, you're saying you've served the, 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 the letter to the High Court one because um, uh, as of the 20th of January, uh, Princess uh, Masala Nabo is, according to you, now installed in the throne, is the rightful heir, just waiting uh, for a letter uh, from the president to confirm that. And therefore you see no point in continuing with the matter. It would just be an unnecessary cost for you at this point. But I listen to the uh, Mujaji Royal Council. They, they've got a different interpretation of, of, of this situation, of the matters. And maybe they, you can help us with, 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 with that clarity. One, they are citing the last appearance in the High Court, where a court, uh, they say, emphatically said to you, one, you were a foster parent by default, a, a self imposed foster parent uh, so to speak so in their view you were an outsider who came in and interfered with, with, with their processes uh, wh what's your response to that firstly there is nothing on earth called mujaji royal council there is mujaji traditional council established in terms of uh, the bantu authorities Act of 68 of 1951. This uh, Mujaji Royal Council is a creation of the imagination uh, of a so-called Mujaji Royal Council. It does not exist. And uh, I was uh, appointed a foster parent by a Randbeck Children's Court in the presence of those people who say that I'm an imposter. And uh, in fact, the regent, Mpapata uh, Mujaji, uh, was appointed a regent for Masa, uh, 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 Queen elect Masala Mujaji the seventh. And along the way, he decided that he's regent for uh, Mujaji Royal Nation. There's nothing like that on earth. So they created structures which do not exist under the law of South Africa, which do not exist in terms of the Balawidi customs and uh, traditions. Yeah. So uh, I am not, I have not withdrawn from court. The court said I have no legal authority to represent the Queen, because the judge also did not understand what he was talking about. And then uh, I'm saying, if the court say I don't qualify to be in that court, what am I still going to do in that court? Because we have achieved what we wanted, to stop the coronation of a king, because from 1800, there is no king in Uruvedu, it is queens. And therefore, for us to go to court is a waste of money, is a waste of time, because President Jacob Zuma correctly recognized her, her, her Majesty Queen-elect Masala Mujaji as the sole and only queen of Valoredi Royal Nation. And President Ramaphosa, in the presence of uh, President Zuma, announced that decision at a stadium and said that when she turns 18, uh, she will take over. Yeah. She turned 18 uh, in January, so she's in power now. She's yeah. just waiting for the certificate uh, of uh, recognition, so there's no other challenger. Right. Because these other, these other guys are wanting a king, which is impossible. So they, they, they are saying, for example, you, you, are, you are withdrawing, okay, that's their vision, you've given us yours, um, uh, because you've recognized that you are fighting a losing battle. In fact, this is the end of the road for you. Uh, it, it nullifies all the attempts that uh, you have tried at least over the, the past three years to delay them from installing their rightful leadership 
of the value being you, you know, if you deal with people who use anger and emotions, who do not even understand the customs and traditions of the nation they claim to represent, you will have, uh, you know, claims like that. The truth of the matter is that I had not withdrawn. I ceased to be a foster parent by operation of law, and therefore I don't qualify to be in court, but also there's nothing that I need from the court because all that we needed was to stop the absurdity of installing a king uh, in a place where there's no kingdom. And so Her Majesty Masalama Mujaji is in charge now. She has set up a royal family. She has a royal uh, council and uh, she's in charge and everything is running. And these rebels uh, are confused now. They don't know what to do. They say they served summons on her to appear in court, but uh, she's not part of the proceedings. She doesn't need to be in court. So both of us don't need to be in court because we have what we wanted. That is a status as Her Majesty Queen Masalun Mujaji the Seventh. The rebels are out in the cold because there's no king kingdom in Vuluvedu. There's only a queenship and the queen is in place and her place cannot be challenged. So it's a, it's a fabrication, this thing of theirs. They're saying, no, they've served papers because they want courts to, 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 to bring clarity on this matter. You're saying, where you sit now, there's no court matter that needs to sit there, on this. There's no, there's no court matter because I am not part of the proceedings. The queen is not part of the proceedings. The uh, former regent has also ceased to be a regent. He's the person who, brought, uh, who was defending the matter. So the main parties to the matter are the regent and myself. We are both disqualified by operation of law to be in court. So there's no matter in court. So there's no dispute. The only thing is that we have a majesty, Queen Masalanum Mujaji the seventh, who is on the throne if I in terms of the customs and traditions of a very royal nation, but under the South African law, uh, she needs to receive a certificate of recognition. That certificate doesn't make her a queen. It's just a formality in terms of the law. But uh, the position is determined by the customs and traditions, and that position is settled, is guaranteed, Nobody can change it. Yeah. So all yeah. that we want is a certificate of recognition, which will come soon because even government has no choice. Government cannot uh, uh, go and change that position. Uh, anybody want the position and change, they must review the decision of parliament. I think no self-respecting president can take a decision and change it willy-nilly uh, outside this, uh, the, uh, the spirit in terms of the law. So let's talk about those customs and traditions. They're, they are saying there are some necessary undertakings that were supposed to have happened uh, from the child's birth up until this particular point, and the regent uh, is reported to be saying that you denied them access. Uh, they approached you. In fact, they're using a, even stronger words that you kidnapped the princess. Uh, all this time, and they couldn't undertake those necessary uh, rights and traditions. You see, if people don't use their mind, they use terms like kidnap. Kidnap is a criminal offense. They would have gone to the police to get me arrested. So they are just losing terms uh, loosely. The truth of the matter is that the queen was uh, initiated into the rituals by the Mukoto family, who are the legitimate progenitors of the queens, uh, the regent, that Ronin uh, uh, Murasel, they don't even qualify to enter the ritual place. So how would they have trained her if they don't even qualify to enter the ritual place? So they are just uh, uh, saying what they think. I think allow them to go ahead, but... Uh, the truth of the matter is that uh, the queen is in place and uh, that cannot be changed by anybody.
Dr. Matola Mutsecha, appreciate your time. Thanks uh, for coming on. That is Dr. Matola Mutsecha there, uh, the now former guardian of uh, Princess uh, Masala Nabo Mujaju, who says as soon as she turned 18, 20th of January, uh, she, of course, uh, by uh, operation of uh, the law, uh, he ceased to be the legal guardian and, the, and therefore had no standing in the courts. But he's happy that at least they've achieved what they sought to achieve, which was to block uh, the kingship of the uh, Kukela uh, and instead install a queen as has always been uh, in the Balubedu uh, tradition.